You called it. And did he get there? That's the question. It's going to be very, very close. Marshall hit, and it depends on the spot. It looked like he was stopped short of the first down. Bungie lost his foot and somehow maintains his balance. And it'll be fourth down. Shaq Quarterman brings him down for a sack. I want a touchdown to give me hope. Surratt play action. Under pressure, down he goes. Shaq Quarterman dragged him down. Points were on the board. Replay took him off. Quarterman with the stop. Good defenses do this, right, Jason? They do. They bail you out, and I don't mind the call, to be perfectly honest with you. 42, it would be his long. And it's a pick. Fritz is dropped at the 20-yard line. Choice shifts to the left, second and goal. Gaines crowd the center of the line. Choice met right there. And will be dropped again, short of the goal line by Shaq Quarterman and Zach McLeod, two linebackers. Is running the offense. It's different than Deshaun, but obviously incredibly effective. And the quarterback hands off to Fuller, who is swarmed under for a two-yard loss to Tom Rinaldi. Really good job of mixing up a lot of different looks. McLeod in motion again. They fake it to him and hand it to Feaster, who's hit right. And especially Michael Carter already. A play fake. Elliott trying to keep it. That is the wrong place to go. You challenge Shaq Quarterman, and a lot of times you go backwards. to star for the Hurricane Shaq Quarterman. We're going to hear from him when we come back here to Miami. 3 nothing. Carolina with the lead. He changes him every week. They will rush four, and here comes the pressure. The ball is out. Scooped up the Hurricanes defense into the end zone. Touchdown, John Garvin. After Quarterman got the hit and forced the fumble. Oh. Well, we talked about Manny Diaz dialing up defenses, right? Here you can see the left end. He steps up three yards, comes in loops underneath. They get a two-on-one on the guard. He comes free, gets the sack, the fumble, and then you get the touchdown hey, for the Hey, you talk about a great look. Look who's making that. The left end was Shaq Quarterman. You don't really see that look coming from Manny Diaz. That might be one of those defenses of the week for North Carolina. Right, that's a great job by him because he stepped a linebacker up into the B gap. First and 10 into Miami territory. And Carter this time just had nowhere to go. And guess who leading away? Shaq Quarterman having a huge first half for Miami. You gotta keep the tailback running game going. And I think they have done both. They got better than 140 yards rushing. So that though is gonna be flipped over. Does a somersault as Shaq Quarterman gets another tackle, and now a timeout is used. Perkins sees trouble coming, and down he goes. Miami's Shaq Quarterman got in there. Pat Bethel at the defensive tackle positions. Your escape hatch is not down. Second down for Perkins. Pressure coming, and down he goes. Shaq Quarterman back at the 15-yard line. I mean, wasn't bluffing. In the end, Quarterman comes unblocked, and there just weren't enough. It can be advantageous for wide receivers if they can be on time and get their footing. A run with Jackson, and wrapped up by Shaquille Quarterman, the junior middle backer. Second and five here for Duke. Bandy is back in there in the secondary now for the Kings. They'll run it with Jackson. Maybe got back to the line of scrimmage. Shaquille Quarterman was right there. For Miami, they benefited from it, and Georgia Tech really struggled on that, uh, that last defensive drive for Miami in that second half, which allowed the Canes to get another score. Paying homage to the former head coach Frank Beamer by selecting a special teams player of the week to wear number 25. Picked up. That's Shaq Quarterman. Shaq still on his feet. And inside the five, first and goal, Hurricanes. Get Quarterman, watch his eyes. He's going to be sitting right here. Go ahead and roll that. And I love the fact that he keeps his eyes on the quarterback. 
Eyes on the quarterback, steps in front of the slant. Excellent job by the junior linebacker. Read it the whole way, steps in front. And a huge... As good as I've seen him in several weeks. And speaking of healthy, Peoples back in the ball game. Little jailbreak screen to Trey Turner, who caught that touchdown a moment ago. Third down and nine for Virginia Tech. Blitz coming, and Willis is sacked back at the nine-yard line. Outside, he's going to bring pressure. Quarterman also going to bring Carter right there. Quarterman's blocked initially. It's Carter that comes clean, flushes Finley, and you'll see Quarterman, mm. the instinctive football player he is. This is where Pickett has really developed, the command at the line of scrimmage. Pickett in trouble and engulfed. A huge loss. Jackson was in the backfield. About where it looks like a blitz. I mean, you tell me, does this look like a blitz or not? It's not. This is just a Second team. Four. Not much there. That time denied on that left side. No place to go. Shaq Quarterman with his first tackle. There on his left side. That's playing quarterback. And some poise too. Carter trying to scamper back inside. I'm in the pocket. Fox with his third sack of the ball game. He's been the defensive star. Backing up Newsom. Not trying to spin free. Deep and taken down inside the five. All of a sudden, you've blocked the best defensive player or defensive lineman for Miami with your quarterback. Carter with the reception. Scampering across the 50. Quarterman racing him out of there. He came in as a two-star, and now he started two, make it now three games. How about that for the Stars? Not meaning a lot. Yeah, and gained a lot of weight, too, and that says an awful lot about that young man. Come with a little bit of pressure on the quarterback, and good dump off on the screen out for a six-yard game. First down, Virginia, and a handoff. I don't know about that one. They'll use their final timeout. Virginia offense, they got the ball first here. In the second half, trailing 7-3. to three. They got their field goal on the last play of the first half. A crossing route. Cease Dubois with the catch. He had a nice first half for Virginia. Most veteran player on this Miami team. Mason cannot break away. In fact, would get back to the line and no more. And third and ten coming up as Quarterman makes the tackle again. Shaq Quarterman here in the middle of your screen. Watch how he plays this. He's physical at the point of attack. He's going to fill the hole, make the tackle. Sending Griffin now with Graham. First and ten. And here goes Jemias Griffin again. And Rousseau slows him down. And then Miami collapsed with Quarterman. Highly old vet's going to figure it out. He starts there in the middle of your screen. Gets going with that action. Oh, wow. Ooh, that, that is called arriving with bad intentions, Wes. I always hated that as a running back when you're trying to cut back and the linebacker's got a downhill shot at. Trying to sneak one back through the middle and the ball popped out. Miami is recovered. Trying to sneak one back through the middle and the ball popped out. Miami is recovered. The senior linebacker able to come up with a big play. He's able to punch the ball out, then recover. Sunday will be exactly one year, folks, from the tragic mass shooting at the Tree of Life Synagogue here in Pittsburgh. Uh, Blades. Doink, doink there. Dad also played at the University of Miami. Davis on the run. And over to go there. It's going to be third down and long. The Canes defense missing Michael Pickney, one of their emotional leaders. Went a few weeks ago against Wake. Pass complete. Davis out of the backfield. Took that ball off the top of his shoes. And Shaq Quarterman finally made the tackle. Test me, Jones. <laughs> <laughs> Here's Davis. And Davis keeps those feet moving to pick up seven yards heavy run two straight plays on the left side of this offensive line running up line up with two tailbacks and a nice stick Carter. by quarterman 
a textbook tackle on the play. Kentucky at USF, and now they went Wildcat a bunch last week with Cam Akers, and they're going to start off with the Wild Cam here on first down, but he lost a yard. Akers, nowhere to go. Shaq Quarterman, a tackle for loss back to the 14-yard line. That's a loss of about five. Look at Quarterman, no hesitation. Outstanding first step and beats the tackle outside. Just rolled. A safety into the slot. There's the handoff. And wrestling his way across the five out to about the seven yard line is Akers. The formation that they scored on, they put him out there, move him back in. Swing pass to Akers. Nowhere to go. They couldn't block it up for him. Shaq Quarterman does it again. Your senior seen a lot, been through a lot in his career. This is Hawkins. Nowhere to go over that left side. He's going to lose about three yards on the play. Shaq Quarterman making a stop for the Hurricanes defensively. I mean, he diagnosed a play right now. Comes underneath the block. Makes a play by the entire way. For Louisville. Hands it off again, and a tackle made by Shaq Quarterman. I want to tell you a, bit, a little bit more about Shaq Quarterman. Second and ten. Cut back, but nowhere to go by JV and Hawkins. Boy, this Miami front has been impenetrable at times. Miami, remember, still with a chance at the Coastal Division title. Hall brought down. High snap. Connolly hands it off to Davian Hawkins, and he's bottled up at about the 48-yard line. Best pass rushes in the entire conference. I expect Greg Rousseau to have a big day. Deion Jackson, and not much there. Try and get something going for an offense that has struggled in the second half. And Jackson denied on the second and short, so third and the same. 